Look at all this. I can't believe all this is left behind. <gasps> Jimmy, there's something on that train. I've just seen it through the window. I sat on the chair and then it felt like something went inside me. Has anyone died on this train before? Yo, I just found Donald Trump and the Korean president inside of this abandoned train. What's up guys, I'm Osarji, welcome back to another epic video. Before we get started on today's video, I need y'all to take the largest train you can possibly find, smash the hell out of that like button. I got a really cool adventure for y'all today. I'm actually here with Jimmy. What's up Jimmy? What's up? And today we're about to film about 14 to 15 abandoned trains. Just sitting here, we never knew these existed. My friend Jamie, AKA Rhythm Rider on YouTube, gave me this location. So big shout out to Jamie, thank you so much for this location. Um, I'm about to explore all these abandoned trains. I've never seen this many abandoned trains just sitting here and apparently there's a lot left behind. People have died on these trains, which is why they're decommissioned. These trains are in terrible condition and some of them are in amazing condition. I don't know what we're gonna find, but I need y'all to watch the video to the end of the video for something epic at the end. So smash that like button again, like I said, take the biggest train, smash the hell out of that like button let's go all right y'all making our way on the first abandoned train as you guys can see this is super cool keep your eyes out for any ghosts or spirits or something look at this i've never been on an abandoned train like this before this is really cool i'm using a different camera i don't have okay i think that was just the one jimmy i'm using a different camera today um Canon G5X, it's really good at nighttime. It's not as wide as lens as my Canon M50. If I do need it, I will bring it out. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this camera being used in the videos. But hey, look at this. This is really, really interesting. All the seats are still here. I've been on, on quite a bit of abandoned trains before, but never like this. Like all the seats are still here, the cushions are here. Wow, I like it. Honestly, I kind of do want to bust out my wide angle lens because this, this camera is just not showing how awesome and wide and big this is like it's a train i really hope we can find one of these trains at least that has like the engine on it and like maybe the steering or the conductor's place or whatever it's called look at this this is a toilet right here reminds me of like an airplane pretty cool i can't believe these trains are just laying here in the middle of nowhere and they're not even that badly destroyed like yes some kids have probably broken the windows but the cushions are still here and i'm not seeing that much graffiti i'm eager to see what's inside all the other trains so what do you guys say we move on to the next one as you guys can see this is the other train right here we're about to jump right onto it and make our way down the rail um these trains are all kind of connected but they're separated maybe it, there's been a big accident and they just eventually left everything here i have no idea i don't know much history about these trains but let me just show you how good this camera is at nighttime like it's literally midnight right now and it's kind of like daylight outside good camera all right y'all making my way into the other train each one of these trains is actually named something different the hell oh that's jimmy Jimmy's walking up because it's kind of hard to actually climb up into this one. It's on a bit of a higher grade, but look at how cool this is. Really creepy vibes. I really wish the windows weren't broken because you could hear all the noise from the highway. Oh man, this one's way more destroyed. This kind of reminds me of like an abandoned building. Look at this. Wow. Again, take a look at how destroyed this one is from this angle. You can barely walk through it, to be honest. I couldn't film just trying to walk in through here. So this is train cart number two. I think there's 14 in total. I'm really hoping we can find something. Hey, check it out. There's some control panels over here left behind. It looks like a Wi-Fi, and it looks like some type of VCR. Yamaha Natural Sound. Yeah, it's some type of stereo system, actually. Kind of dangerous, but... This place is crawling with cops. So I gotta be on the lookout in case any cops roll up on us. I mean, there's no signs that say I can't be here. So, whoa. If you guys see this, I'm standing perfectly straight right now and see how tilted this one is. Really crazy, man, I like this. I've noticed one thing, every train here is a different um, 
color Look on the inside, like the seating and everything. How cool would it be to do an overnight challenge in this place? This has definitely got that 70s vibe to it. Everything here spits out 70s to me. Look at the way these are. I mean, I'm sure this is kind of older than 70s, but this one's kind of cleaner and all the cushions are literally still here. It's red. It's red, right? Or, or red or orange, some type of color. But the fact that the cushions are still here and I can sit down, chill on this table, have a snack here, I'm thinking I might try to do an overnight challenge someday. Let me know in the comments below if y'all want me to come camp out here, order some pizza to the train. You guys remember a long time ago, I did a video on an abandoned train. I got in a lot of trouble for that video and it had to be removed. Um, but we actually ordered pizza and we tipped the driver $100. So that was really cool. But I mean, hey, this one's in a totally different country. So maybe I should do it. Let me know if you guys think I should come back here. As you guys can see, that's the other train car over here. Pretty cool. I still haven't found the engine room, if there even is one. I really hope so. Right now, these are all just the carts for the trains. I'm gonna show you guys what these look like on the outside when I'm done filming here. I think this one might be first class because it's looking a little bit different. It's got wood trim everywhere. Oh yeah, oh my God, this is definitely different than all the other ones. Wow, I, I gotta have to, I'm gonna have to bust out my, it's a kitchen, bro. Yeah. I'm gonna have to bust out my wide lens. All right, y'all, I've thrown on my other lens, which is much wider on my other camera, which is a Canon M50. This is what the kitchen looks like now. As you guys can see, you can see more into it. And I'm thinking it's the kitchen. It looks like a kitchen. It looks like there might've been some sort of grill here. Like there's the hood for the grill right there. Pretty interesting. I really hope there's some more cool shit inside of this train. All right, so this looked like it was like private quarters. Basically, this has definitely got to be first class over here. <laughs> yep, definitely first class. This is really cool. There's a chandelier in here. Two chairs. That's amazing. I've, I've got the secret obsession with trains. I don't know what it is, but I love trains. Moving further and further. There's another little secret room here with a chair. <gasps> what the fuck was that? Whoa, look at this room over here. Now this... It's beautiful to me. Wow, I can feel the ground just shaking beneath my legs. Look at all this. I can't believe all this is left behind. Like, I've never discovered anything like this before. This is awesome. This is putting a big smile on my face. Jim, Jimmy is back down that way. He's keeping an eye on the windows for me, making sure no security or cops roll up on me while I film this. But look at this. This is beautiful. If you don't see beauty in destruction like this, then I highly suggest you go out there and you try something like this and then come back and talk to me because you'll definitely find that beauty because this is beauty. I see beauty in destruction. I see beauty in everything. You guys are beautiful to me, but this right here, this right here is it's just one of a kind. I, I really love this. Yo, I legit was just filming a cinematic and then I turn off my camera and I literally heard like a female scream, like a little girl screaming in here. Either that was Jimmy or it's just the wind. I don't know. But it sounded like a female scream coming from that direction right over there. And honestly, there's like literally 10 other trains. I'm kind of spooked out by all this and I'm hoping, I'm hoping nothing jumps out at me. But I want you guys to keep your, what the fuck was that? It felt like something was just walking here right beside me. Hello? It literally felt like there was just something walking right here. Damn. Really wish I had the spirit box with me. Damn, that'd be a cool video. Let me know if you guys want me to come back here and play with the spirit box. All right, Jimmy just caught up with me. I'm getting some weird vibes as I progress more and more into these trains. Like, it's really cool that we can just progress into these, you know? Is this your first time on a train? Uh, I was on one when I was a kid. But, like... This is my first time on a train like this. <laughs> yeah, this one's definitely the first class. I'll tell you that one. Yeah, look at the bathroom. It's a bit bigger than all the other bathrooms. I've never seen this. Whoa. There's so much destruction everywhere. But there's another cart right there. And I'm about to go inside. Holy crap, when I tell you guys every train is different than all the others, you best believe I ain't lying about that because look at this one. This was actually, it looks like a kitchen. Yeah, this is definitely the kitchen. I don't think the other one was the kitchen. Pretty sure this one here was the kitchen. 
this is so cool. Look at this. I can't believe all of this is actually on a train, an abandoned train. Now, for those of you that have been on trains your whole life and you've seen shit like this, this may not be exciting, but to me, this is hella exciting. Like, this excites the shit out of me. What the fuck was that? And boom! Scared the crap out of me. Bro, I heard a knock right here. Did you know there was another window? No, but look at this. There's a fridge over here. Let me know in the comments below if you know what kind of stuff they were keeping this fridge. Oh, I think I know what this is. Huh? They used to like roast. No, I think they would keep the like the pre-packaged food warm. Right. Like on an airplane. All right. They keep all the pre-packaged foods warm here. It's cool though. Here's What's close. through? What's through here? This is such a creepy hallway right here, man. I'm so happy that I have my other camera with the wide lens. It's so much better. The other camera is definitely better at nighttime. But holy shit, this is a bar. Yo, there's a bar here. This is amazing. Wow, every cart has something new to offer. I, I really wonder what the last one has in it. All right, so we've been through first class. We've been through regular class. We've been through the bar and the kitchen area. This was definitely the bar. Let's see what else we can find. Really hope nothing jumps out at me, but hey. There's footprints right there in the snow. Could be rabbit, it looks like rabbit. But it also looks like it's going inside the other train right here. Damn, what a train wreck this is. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Anyways. Three, two, one. It ain't that deep at all. Alright, making my way on the next train over here. I don't know how many trains I've been on so far, but I want you guys to keep a I want you guys to keep a train counter. Let me know in the comments below how many times I've said the word train in this video. I know I probably said it a lot, but hey, you know. Ugh, it's hard walking in this one because it's literally on a slant. Like I'm trying to walk, but I'm slanted. So it was kind of making me nauseous. I want to get. Whoa, 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 what the hell was that? Smells bad. Nah, bro. This whole train just shook for a second there. I feel like this train right here is about to flip over. It's literally on a big, big angle. It's kind of making me nauseous. So well, this might be a quick video. This might be a long video. I don't know what to expect from it, but I want you guys to stay with me. There might be something really cool at the end. There's more trains to explore. And guess what? I actually did bring the spirit box. I have it with me in my backpack. So I will be trying it out on the last one or the dining one, the, the main one that had the luxury stuff in it because that one looked like it was the creepiest to be honest. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's the other trains right there. I'm gonna go on top of them. I'm gonna turn off my light, go outside. The reason why I turn off my light is because I don't want people seeing me. Oh, look at that. These have been spray painted to shit. Wow, this is so cool. What an adventure this is. Are you guys, <gasps> Jimmy? There's something on that train. I just seen it through the window. Are you kidding? Yeah, I just seen something move inside. I've seen something white move inside. What the fuck was that, dude? There's something literally on that train. I'm not I'm not kidding you guys. I, I just seen something. Watch your step here. This is a very dangerous little exit here. I don't know if I want to go inside of this one. Careful, careful, you okay? I just made my way onto this other one. And this is one of the, the coach class, I'm guessing. This is where I thought I seen something inside. I don't know, it could have been my eyes playing tricks on me. You good? Yeah. I thought I seen something literally big and white and moving and I couldn't have been able to catch it on camera. But this just looks like every other one of those other carts. I think special in this one. <gasps> Whoa! The menu! This was the food menu. This is what they served here on the train. Look at that. Lasagna. Um, fish and chips, I'm guessing that's what that is. Chicken, whoa, oven roasted chicken, and I'm sure this is roast beef. That's cool. Bro, if I was on this train, I would literally buy one of everything. I kid you not. If y'all don't know this, I'm a big eater. When most Sarge is hungry, he's hungry. I have a saying, if there ain't no meat, I don't eat. All right, and this is heaven to me right now because I'm kind of hungry, I'm kind of hungry. But anyways, enough joking around. Let's move along and see what else we can find. So I'm making my way onto the last two trains before I head back and try to use the spirit box in one of those rooms. Look at how, this one must have been like the shittiest class. Like you have the, the coach, you have the premium, the luxury, 
and then you have this shitty one I can tell by the seats they don't look that comfortable but hey this is still cool to look at but there's something different at the end of this one I don't know what it is but this is super cool wow another kitchen you think well there's still one more train attached to this one this is actually pretty big whoa there's a big bathroom in here oh, shoot. everything is good when you're taking that fat poop <laughs> that's weird what is this? huh oh look at that I even noticed that Okay, why would there be a, a disabled sticker on a door that just leads down that way? Unless that was like a, maybe a disabled person entrance, if you have a wheelchair or something. I know you heard that. I didn't hear it, but I have my, I turned off my camera. Your camera knows for sure. No, I accidentally turned off my camera. What? Thing. You heard a lot of noise outside. I heard like a whine. I heard, I heard like a girl whining, bro. I don't know about you, but I really heard that. And I wasn't even recording. See, this is why I should keep my finger off the damn recording button. So the way I hold my camera is I have my thumb always on the record button if I need to record. But the problem is when something spooks me, I sometimes accidentally, my thumb literally hits the button and turns the camera off. Which sucks, because I get to, I miss I miss things that happen. So right now, I got my thumb somewhere else. Jimmy, be careful, this is a very weak floor over here. So these two trains are connected to another train. And I don't know what the heck is going on in here. Oh look, it's Donald Trump. Where? Yo, I just found Donald Trump and the Korean president inside of this abandoned train. That is awesome. I'm sure that's Donald Trump, right? I legit just found Donald Trump and the Korean president inside of an abandoned train. Literally, this is cool. All right guys, now that we've, uh you know, met Donald Trump over here. Yo, Trump, my boy. What's going on? You chilling? That is definitely Trump. And it's the, Kim. the North Kim. Is that his name? Kim? Kim Jong-un, Jong I think. I think that's his name. And hey, listen. If you don't like Trump or you like Trump, I really don't give two shits. Keep your politics away from me. I don't care about politics. I don't care about these presidents. I don't care about your president. I don't care about my president. All I care about is Tom, my boy. Yo, Tom, my boy, you piece of shit. Fuck. Should not have said that, but it's okay. We got to carry on. Move along. La Piche. It's funny, I, haven't, I had an ex-girlfriend with that last name. Maybe this was her train. I don't know. That was a long time ago. Yo, what the f*** is that? Uh, hello? Who's there? Whoa. Bro, I just seen a face in the window. I seen someone standing in the window. Not even joking. Like I seen an actual human standing in the window. Hello? Hold up, Jimmy. Let me go first. Anyone here? I see a lot of footprints, bro. Footprints? Not ours. Footprints? We didn't even walk out this way. Oh, these are fresh footprints. I told you I thought I seen someone. What the fuck? Oh my god. That's just my phone. I get notified anytime somebody drives by my house. I got cameras all over my house and it's got a notification. Scared Jimmy. But yo, Jimmy, look what I just seen. Another picture of Kim Jong-un. Except this time, his eyes are all distorted. Whoa. This is the creepiest thing I've seen in a very, very long time. Not gonna lie. Dang. Send nudes. Okay. Anyways, moving along. I thought I seen... Ha, no, it's impossible, dude. I seen somebody standing here. But look, you can't go out anywhere from here. All the doors here are locked. Oh this one's God. got a chain on it. And this is high up. And there's nowhere else to go. So that's very strange. And this is, this is very high up. This is very, very strange. Keep your eyes open, Jimmy. Yeah, be might right. be somebody stalking us. We're making our way back to the luxury train. We might try to play the spirit box there. Just see what we can get. I yeah, I seen that. There was a light down that train right there. We just seen a light just turn off as we're walking. It might be security, so we gotta be careful. Here, we should hide behind the train, move back. 
That was very freaky. See the red light? Yeah, there's a red light over there. Oh, we'll see brake lights. Yeah, I hope it's not security. We should walk from behind the train. Okay, Jimmy and I are on the luxury part of the train, but we're getting some really weird vibes right now. It's it's about 1.30 or almost 2 o'clock in the morning right now, but I don't know. What do you think? Should we try to play the spear box? Huh? Yeah, let's do it. 100%. Me and Jimmy thought we seen some guys, so we're kind of shook up about it. Also, we thought we seen a car pull up. I oh, know. What is that? Well, we didn't notice that on the way here. No, we didn't. I don't think it was here. It's a wig. Ew. That's gross. Look, we just found someone's wig. 6 9 <laughs> Takashi 6 ix wig, everybody. We found it. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. All right, you guys. I got the spirit box with me. I'm just going to just do this for fun. Ask it a couple of questions. See who's died here. I don't know. Maybe tell my boy is here. So here we go. I'm going to start scanning through the channels. I'm going to ask some questions. So in three, two, one. Hello, spirits of the demon world. Did I just hear somebody say, oh shit? <laughs> so here's the thing with these spirit boxes. Sometimes they catch radio frequencies from the dead. Or sometimes they catch just actual radio sound. So you got to get lucky. So let's see if we can capture a voice as this thing is scanning. And usually when it skips a beat, it's usually when we made a connection. You guys know recently when I was in Florida, I was at the Haunted Fort Day Road. And you can literally see a red orb coming out of the gra coming out of the grave and going right inside the spirit box. And you guys all saw that and you all freaked out about it. If you didn't see it, go check out my recent Fort Day video. All right, here we go. Are there any spirits on this train? Has anyone died here before? Has anyone died on this train before? A lot. I heard something say a lot. Me! You heard that? Who? Wait. Who's me? Who are you? What is your name? <gasps> what is that? Did you not feel that? Did you not feel that? Bro, oh, no, like, I'm not even joking. I, like, my whole body just shook. It, my, the chair just shook. It felt like something. If there's any spirits here, what is your name? Alex. I swear I heard Alex. That was Alex. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Yo, Alex, my boy, was that you that just shook my chair like that? Ha. Bro, I know he's, he said ha. He fucking said ha. He laughed. Yo, Alex, are you mean? Are you evil? Do you want to hurt me or what? Alex, do you want to hurt me? Yo, Alex, my boy, do you mean to bring me any harm? Can't get nothing from Alex, my boy. Yo, Alex, are we allowed here? Should we be here or do you want me to leave? Yes, leave. Okay, I'm out. Okay, that was fucked. That was fucked. You heard that, right? Bruh. Yes, leave now. Let's get the hell out of here. I feel a weird breeze. It's just the wind, but Alex literally just said, yes, leave now. What the fuck was that? My eyes are fooling me now. Bro, that, that vibration that I felt on the chair, literally, it was like something went inside of me in the chair. Tell me, that's why I didn't feel it, bro. I, didn't, didn't, I didn't feel it. You didn't feel it? I sat on the chair. And then it felt like something went inside me. Let's get the fuck out of here, Jimmy.
I think we've overstayed our welcome on this abandoned train. I talked to something named Alex. I don't know what it was, but I'm gonna turn off my light right now as I'm making my way outside. 